हेलो नमस्ते सलाम वालेकुम सत्रीकाल वेलकम बैक टू अनदर सेशन विथ योर वॉश ऑफ एट वारेवा डॉट कॉम टूडे वी गोइंग टू लर्न हाउ टू मेक अडाई यू नो वॉट इज द डिफरेंस बिटवीन अडाई एंड दोसा यू नो द बैटर ऑफ दोसा ऑल्सो कैन बी मेड सिमिलर बट दोसा बैटर्स आर यूजली फॉर्मेंटेड वेर एज इन द अडाई यू नो वी एनरिच बाई एडिंग मोर लेंथल्स यू डू नॉट फॉर्मेंट द बैटर यू कैन मेक द अडाई राइट अवे लेट्स लर्न हाउ टू मेक दिस अडाई बैटर सो फर्स्ट वी गोइंग टू यूज तुअर दाल चना दाल एज आई टोल्ड यू देर इज नो हार्ड एंड फास्ट रूल दैट यू यूज ओनली दीज दाल इफ यू वॉन्ट टू एड मूंग दाल उड़द दाल यू कैन एड एंड इन दिस एड राइस द रेड चिलीज एंड करी लीव्स ओके वी गोइंग टू एड वॉटर जस्ट वॉश इट वंस ड्रेन द वॉटर एंड देन अगेन वी गोइंग टू यूज फ्रेश वॉटर टू टोक दिस इंग्रीडियंट्स द रेसिपी इज ऑल्सो वेरी सिंपल इफ यू टेक वन कप ऑफ राइस You add one tablespoon of chana dal, one tablespoon of tuar dal. But you can also increase or decrease the amount of dals depending on the consistency or the texture you want. If you want little crispy, you can increase the rice quantity. If you want it little soft, increase the dal quantities. And in this, we are going to add some salt, hing. Now add so much water that it should little be over the rice. You know, it should not be too much. because we added the rice and the hing you don't want to lose the flavor later by draining the water you know after adding this water you need to soak it for at least 2 hours you know 4 hours of overnight is also possible and by the time this all this water will be absorbed if you have any water left over after you know soaking it for more than 2 3 hours that means you added too much water so don't add too much water because when you make this batter you want the batter to be slightly thicker not like a dosa batter little bit coarse and thicker you know put this in a blender and make this into a coarse paste you know look at this how grainy it is you don't want it to be fine then your adai won't be that good so look at this texture once again nice grainy now you know the batter is all ready let's go ahead and learn how to spread this adai adai is usually slightly thicker but the thing is the fun part is making holes you know in this i'm going to make little holes you're going to see how many holes and why we do so many holes okay now take the batter and just uh, pour this batter on the hot tawa and usually traditionally what they used to do they used to take some water wet their hands and then spread this batter on to the tawa and then just spread this into the thickness you want some people like it little bit thicker some people not so but basic thickness is this much now for this we going to make holes usually they make either one hole you can make one hole three holes five holes i don't know what is this obsession of making this number of holes they never make two and four never even odd numbers so one hole is already ready and the next two holes i'm going to make here make here and next two holes you know make here and make here see the more crispier you want the more holes you make that way you enjoy your life even better and now add oil onto this because i like it little crispier i'm going to add little extra oil this should be good enough now we want the batter to cook because this is not like dosa not thin batter slightly thicker so you can put a lid on it and just a transparent one so that you can see what's happening in there and we going to let it cook on a slow flame and uh, putting this lid on top and cooking is also a technique because you don't want the moisture to escape right away you want this adai to cook nice at the same time you don't want it to burn very fast so in the slow browning gives even coloring so when you put a lid like this it will create a kind of a pressure there and cook but after one or two minutes of uh, cooking we're going to remove the lid off and we're going to let the moisture evaporate and letting our adai come nice and slightly crispy after 2 minutes you know look at this wow and very nice coloring and look at the top this the color from white it's become slightly pale but the real reason is look at this nice even coloring happens when you do it just press this little bit and now we are not going to put the lid this time okay and we are going to cook it on a medium heat after cooking it for uh, around 2 more minutes you will see a nice coloring on top and serve this with jaggery white butter 
and also if you want you can also serve it with coconut chutney wow you know when you are enjoying this hot hot adai i am telling you wow with this either with the coconut chutney hmm or with the gourd that is jaggery wow and with little butter dear friends you know i totally forgot that i am doing a show here and i am thoroughly enjoying here dear friends i hope you enjoyed today's session but do not forget varava is all about inspiring others to cook so please post your recipes and cooking tips at varava.com so others can benefit from your great cooking thank you Thank you.